that's that. Okay. Honestly, first fight here was pretty good. I thought I, th I thought your neutrals on control were pretty pretty good. Um, this is kind of the split I want to be seeing, honestly. Um, yeah, so there's good angles. They're all stacked. The hello's not taking. I mean, maybe sticking a little bit closer to the cover here, so you're taking less damage because again, your arm is really really important to go in. But in terms of distance here, you're really really close, which is good to see. Um, because you don't want to spit spin in from too far away. And then. We go in, so we 4-5 first, so for those who don't know, against Sigma comps, you have to 4-5 first, otherwise you get rocked out of spear spin. Um, normally, the, the cycles is SFS, or spin, 4-5 spin, then it's against Sigma only, it's 4-5 uh, spin. That's why it's 4-5 first. 4-5 is fine. Muffin needs to walk. Oh, why is Muffin so far back? Is on. Ah! Load. It, it do be loading. It's not loading. Ugh, Wi-Fi moments. Is this ring quality really low for anyone else? Yeah, it's fair. Yeah, oh, yeah. it's to it's to do with yeah. But I'll try and not play. I'll try and keep it on like pause as much as I can because I know like Discord spirit rate is not great. Um, but yeah. On. Mm. Going in. There we go. The only thing I'd say is that, like, again, these guys, like, you need to be playing. <coughs> you need to be way more aggressive. I think I whispered to you to, 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 to just use girl. Like, Nihilo is taking a bunch of aggro and you're busy fucking around. Um, but apart from that, I think that cycle is relatively fine. Dude is good. Nade is good. And yeah, now, like, again, like, you're, you're just, your angle here is just, like, nil. Um, so, so yeah. yeah. You stand on those two poles. You can. Yes, you can. Yes, okay. You can. The, pro the problem is, is that it's no cover. There's no cover. Like, yeah. there's, not, there's not really anywhere else I can play other than just going on point and playing close range. And, I mean, the, be the benefit is that, like, you are really, really far away, which means they, they just can't walk onto you. Um, so that's the benefit, I suppose. So, yeah, good neutral overall, multiple angles at once, just a little bit of aggression there from scale. Okay. I'm scared to just, I'm scared to, like, go forward in case it fucking freezes up again. Uh That's fair enough, that's fair. <laughs> two times two is good. Okay, there we go. So again, like here, like I don't know what they're doing. This is just a brain dead rotation through main because they're gonna get shot at from like everywhere, right? So I don't know why they're deciding to do this, but this should be an easy fight for us here. The hack's good. Uh, good javelin, we've got a good angle as well, Muffin should get a good nade. I think, I hope. Yeah, I don't know why he's not. Oh, it's because of the shield, probably. I mean, even then, like, I don't know, like, you see the Hanzo through the wall, like, your, your Hanzo, you know, you don't, you shouldn't, so you see the, you see the Bastion through the wall because of the Hanzo, you know your Hanzo's fine because Kiriko's with them, um, yeah. why not just, like, rotate, like, rotate through main here, and then look for an aid, or even if you're scared about them walking onto you, you can rotate through left side and then get an aid here. I think I did end up going left, but yeah, I just a bit, a bit late with it. Right. Yeah, th there, not yet, there we go. So yeah, it's, you don't actually anti anyone here. So oh, I don't know how I didn't get anyone. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's it's probably out for like a millimeter, but yeah. Yeah, my, my body's just too big. You know? <laughs> <laughs> so that's just good. Yeah, so that's just a bad part of the boxway. Good cover as well. Yeah, that's fine. Uh -uh. Yeah. I think that's fine we lose. And here is like, here's the big thing. So they actually go top left now, which is good. But like, we need to like know this or like scout this out, right? Like, I don't know if like you need to yeah. Sonic like in this area so you know we were we're not coming there. Sonic in somewhere. Near. Maybe. Uh, let's see. I think I called when I saw. Yeah. That. Uh, I also saw in that lot going up top right, and I called it. I was using Sonic. Okay, good Sonic. Okay, fine. Yeah. Fair enough. That's good Sonic there. Um, we need to rotate in time. So, the wall. And now we rotate. Like, actually, the rotation isn't that bad. It's, it's, I thought it was worse, but it's not that bad. So, right, so you can rotate across the high. Oh, I remember this. Oh, yeah. This is... Yeah, then I then I just jump in front of a turret bastion and die. <laughs> <laughs> 
which is a uh, highly high. In you don't have to show it from first person. Okay, <laughs> I think I do. You're, you're yeah, 50. You're, you're tw why? Like why? Right? Like you're up. You're under 8 HP. You're not getting healed up by Kiriko. Why peek that? I, um, I might get a random one shot. Who knows? No, you're right. I don't know why I'm doing that. And that that was about the first is like how are you playing in Kings as well. Like dumb. Like yeah, right. <laughs> Like that, you should have actually died there, honestly. But like here, like you're low HP, you're actually in cover. He's got no nade. Why I pick this? Um, so, all right, yeah, not really, not great there. Um, that that honestly probably causes us this fight here to be lost. Um, I'm fine, guys. I'm okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. Skelly. No, you're right. I need to stop and then, doing that shit. It's I'm really really low HP here. <laughs> Full armor. Oh, yeah, and also Bastion. just needs better cover users here, right? So just playing cover here, and then like it's like similar to like Ryan Fire Strikes, where you charge up the animation before in cover and then peek out. Um, because here you take a ton of damage, right, like 200 H 200 armor there, right? Gone for a javelin, and that's basically it. Um, so yeah. Right, so that's how you lose most of your armor there. Um, just not you know not peeking when they engage. Okay, I mean it's like it's like crazy to me, right? Like it sounds so dumb, like just playing cover well, but that, co that cover there costs us a, a reset all of our armor and calls the skull to die, like just because of cover. Um, so, and then the nano here. Don't tell me you nano the, the, him in four or five, please. Uh, it doesn't stack. Oh. Just two shots there, kind of four fives, right? Should four fives, yeah. Yeah, don't nano him. Don't nano him. Um, I get the the bigger HP thing, right? But he's in four or five. He's already has the forty five percent. You're you're giving him an extra five percent of of armor reduction. That's all your nano's doing. Um, so yeah, wait for four or five to end, then nano him, and then because you'll cycle it, you'll then have his four yeah. five back within like the next yeah, yeah, yeah. eight ish seconds. You can spit spin in that time as well. Um, it just don't stack it over four or five. Yeah. Yeah, but actually, I think like we almost win this fight, right? Um, I mean, the nano here is still good because they're within close range. They use their turret form. Yeah, I think I was. Get... I think I was mainly just. I didn't even see the fortify really. I think I was just scared of him yeah. getting just jumped. Let me see the nade here as well. Um. Load, load, load. Please load game. Oh my fucking god! Okay, here we go. Also, you just, you just need to be a little bit, like, I say closer, but just be within the LOS, right? And then when they drop down, that's when you can play, you can rotate back. Um, yeah, okay. So. But then he was like a Hail Mary. I think I was just, like, trying to save the Halo there. I mean, he's re he should be relatively fine because he's got 4 or 5, so, you know, you can take your turn with the nade. Um, yeah. And then where does Teddy go? Uh, Edward, Edward, Edwards. Okay, so when your hands are dice, because of reasons that, you know, reasons, <laughs> yeah. um, where do you go now? I should go right and look for the bat. I think sure. I was just so flustered, because, like, we all died. I, well, not all. Yeah. One yeah. of us died. I think just some... got a bit lost. Yeah, I, I think it's fine to heal your, 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 your reason here for a little bit. Mm. Um, like this is fine. But not drop. I wouldn't drop. Oh, okay. I wouldn't drop off. No, I wouldn't. First off, yeah. I wouldn't drop. Right. And then when your Arisa gets nanoed or has four fight and gets healed back up mm. with armor, then mm. you can stand here. You have to do your few options. Right. You can stand here, or where can you see Peter? Uh, Keanu. Why Keanu? Nice off angle. Okay. What else? And nothing's nice and safe. Yeah, yeah, right. It's, it's it's all about aggression, right? And this is really the key thing. Yeah. Um, if I see Keanu fuck off because he's he's not getting healed because you're not with him, that's entirely on you, right? So let's see. Now is that right? Like now your your value's nil, right? Because the healing yeah. is completely useless. It's full HP anyway. Exactly, right? And then look at where Keanu's at. He's got actually got an, he's got a really nice crossfire here, right? He's the one who needs to yeah. imagine if you're here right now, right? And then you can mm. actually stand on the sledge. I know it's not. I know you've got no cover here, right? I don't know, you can play around here, you can play around here, you can walk them up here, you find a way, um, you can heal Keanu here, and then look at this angle here onto the, onto the Bastion, right? So now you get a nice trade, right? And then look at Keanu's HP, that's yeah. entirely on you, Enti I, I, I can't, I literally, I can't emphasize this enough, 
right? You as Kyuko, your entire kit is designed to pocket your DPS as aggression. I cannot stress that enough. And this is what's going to lose us as fights. Um, because Kiano's probably going to have to fuck off somewhere. Now, in, now in fact, yeah, he fucks off, right? This is all downtime. All of this is downtime, right? Like, literally, yeah. if you keep him up, you can keep him up, you can play this cover here. I mean, Keanu, I was, I was going to bring this up, right? Like, you can actually play cover here. Again, cover's really, really important. You increase so uptime on Sombra, I can't. Like, it's so important on Sombra, it's so important. Because you've got no mobility. You're not Tracer with blinks. Like, your only mobility is your, your TP, right? Uh, nowadays, right? But, like, you've got, no, you've got no active mobility when you're in the fights. Like, the cover here is so important to use. I can't stress that enough. Um, so, yeah. Like, imagine, like, Keanu, you're, like Kiri, Kiriko, Sombra here, Orisa here, still gets sealed by Muffin, so Muffin's rotating around, as he should. Um, you can even just say, actually, Muffin, you can even... Okay, there's so many things, man, holy fuck. You can even stay here, right? And then you can, you can maybe even uh, look to rotate here, left side, and get a nade, because it's a messy fight, and they're not thinking about that kind of thing. I think it's fine for you to rotate mm. back main, that's fine. Um, but yeah, like, imagine, like, Kiriko, Sombra here, and now, after they finish their cryo, you toss and translocate, EMP, win the fight, right? And then you won that four- you will literally won that fight in a 4v5 because Gal basically threw it, right? That's really, really, really important, right? And, like, I know you kind of, like, maybe you panicked and something, right? Maybe, like, Skull dies, or what, what, panic. You shouldn't- that shouldn't really be the case, right? Just put- again, you can keep pocketing the aggression here from Keanu. Um, that's really, yep. really important. It's like, really, the question is, like, what value are you getting here, right? And it's still- it's like, it's a fairly good angle, right? It's a fairly good angle, right? But we're Sombra. Like, nowhere to be seen. Um, so yeah. And you, get, you basically get negative value here. Like, you basically get negative value. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. Um, yeah. And then the EMP's good. Really good EMP. Cancels both the the, EM, the, the, the ultimates from the enemy team. So good EMP. The real question is, uh, I don't know how we lose this. Because uh, we lose this eventually. So, how do we lose this? I think Lucio didn't die. And he, he got to 1 HP, which I... is unfortunate. Yeah, yeah. He's, he's got beat. Yeah. The 6-1 as well. I don't like the I don't like the Dragon Strike, so yeah, they beat as well, so that's probably why. Ooh, that's only unfortunate. Uh let me go back a little bit. Uh god, the wife fucking connection is so bad, man. Uh Why? Oh my god. There we go. Um, <laughs> okay, so, yeah, like, Im imagine, okay, the EMP's a little bit early, a little bit further, it's gonna take me 20 fucking millennia to do this, but whatever, yeah, okay, this is insane, oh my fucking god, I'm doing this to go back like five seconds, this is crazy, there goes, actually fucking loaded now, holy shit, like imagine if you imagine if you literally like here right and then you shoot the look go away and you shoot you shoot the Lucio here with with Keanu right and then like maybe the Lucio actually dies um so that's really unfortunate there I feel that like Lucio dies that's how low he is man oh my god okay, if he dies that you win that fight so uh. yeah okay still winnable. Okay. Everyone's positioning is not great because you're all down main into a ball comp, which is not how. Yeah. So they're more sustained. Okay. Next fight. I shouldn't have done that. I should have just played. I should have just played on two times speed. I should have just played on two times speed. I will leave the. Wait, wait. watch on SSD. Uh, it's on SSD. Yeah. It's just Wi-Fi. Uh, do you have it on SSD? Oh, okay. It's just my connection, yeah. I've got no Ethernet. Uh, even though, like, I've, I've literally plugged it all in, but, like, it just doesn't work, so... It's brokey! Okay, let's look at this fight. So, again, here, like, they have Flux, and we have nothing, because we used a lot of Televolts last fight, right? Like, yeah, it's a bit- it's gonna be a bit rough. Um, I'm thinking of fight plans here. <sighs> like, probably play really, really far away, because you don't want anyone to get Flux individually. Or as a group, sorry. Um, like, if Muffin's playing for 20 years away, you can easily avoid Flux or live through it. Um, same thing with Skell as well. So, really, I'm looking, like, Skell and, and, and Arkiriko need to, like, really be careful here. The flux. That's not what we do. <laughs> okay, we'll see. 
Oh yeah, Nihil, I think you're going a bit too early here, I think. Um, let's see. Yeah, I got poked out, so I had to go grab Mega. Yeah. Oh, I have to V1 again. Yeah, because what this fight here, like, Nihilo just dies, right? And um, Oh god, don't tell me you... Why? Yeah, let's see. You just take a uh, Bastion grenade, I think, probably? Uh, I think it's just Nihil. icicles. Icicles, right? Yeah. yeah. Not great cover usage. Yeah. Yeah. He takes a bunch of damage, and then you can't heal him in time. Ideally, like right now, you yeah, should really wall. be here. Yeah, a nice wall. Um, it's good. Yeah, it's, it's a good yeah. wall by them. Yeah. Um, but right now you should be here. Would have been a nice nade. Yeah, and then you can like walk up yeah. on here, and then rotate here, and then you're fine. Um, so yeah, yeah. For, for those who don't know, you can actually walk up the symbol. Um, yeah, some people don't know that, but you can do that. That's really unfortunate because I think our our, our setup is actually fairly decent. Um, yeah, because we got somewhere behind, as always is pushing in, our hands has got a good angle. Um, I think this is fairly fine. Also, I probably wouldn't want you to TP to the hands straight away, unless you need to. Um, but yeah, yeah. that's unfortunate. It's flux. Oh, we lose the fight again, because small things, man. We should TP here. TP, TP, TP. Yeah, fine. There we go. A little bit slow. Oh, there was no way, I was so surprised you lived that. So was I, right, when I watched this, when I watched this. Yeah, I would, I'll actually, I'll, you, need to, you need to keep walking forward, like you need to. Yeah, like you need to like keep walking forward there, so like you can actually, the healing it gets quicker, or TP to him when you get it back. Um, Cause that fight is actually winnable there. Yeah, that's a bit unfortunate. Yay! This fight here though, we should, I say we should win, we shouldn't. They, okay, we're going into four ultimates here, so. Ooh. We kill their bastion off spawn. Dude, that was nice. Okay. Question is, where's my Hanzo? He's in Narnia. Okay, so it's a 4v4. Okay, the real question is this. Why... Okay, Keanu, is he still here? Um, like, why not engage her? I wonder where he's going in. I love fucking loads. There we go. Like, your Aurisa's drawing out about 5 billion years worth of aggro. Like, shields out, speed they're speeding onto your Aurisa, rock is out too. Like, look how much aggro your Aurisa's drawing, right? This is just perfect opportunity to, like, actually farm EMP here, right? But, um, you're not doing that, right? So, I don't know why that's the case. Um, he's on, he's on his phone. Yeah. yeah, 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 I'm not sure. Yeah. I should have hacked the signal properly, get rid of his shield. Yeah, hack them a bunch, but burn them, right? We even hack them, eh? Um, and then you can burn her too, right? Like, I don't know why you're not. Do you stop shooting now? You do, right? Yeah. Like, why? I I just don't. You've been AFK here, right? Like. And then, yeah, right? So you basically get. I just don't have my monitor. Uh, bruh. Um, but yeah, basically, no, no value there for like a good 15 seconds, though, right? No EMP, no value. Um. So, yeah, not great. And again, if you want to farm and do things, um, the cover here to use is not really much, right? But probably here, um, probably even here or here, or we, or, or you could rotate around point as well. Um, but yeah, you should have gone in there. Wait, is it just me who doesn't see it? The stream's frozen, I think. Is it frozen? Yeah. Okay. I tell my monitor off. I'll, I'll redo it. I'll just redo it. I turned my I accidentally turned my monitor off. There we go. Hey. So yeah, honestly, that fight there where we lost and we where where Skull died first and we lost that fight, that was probably like the blunder of this map because we give them tons of percentage, we lose like three ults at fights, um, so that really was not a, a, a great fight to lose. But the neutral there was good. So okay, so I'll look at Kings now. Kings will be intrigued. Boy. <laughs> oh, there we go. No. Uh, the, the attack, recession. second point, attack it was not good, man. It was, it was rough. Incoming. The first point attack, I actually think, okay, so as a clarification, um, you need to clear, I know I said go main here, but like, I didn't know they were playing here. Um, just clear the high grounds, right? Like, as five people, walk up here, clear these two, and then you can drop down main, and then you can start taking angles and whatnot. Um, so, so yeah. I mean, you event you win the duel here anyways, but just for reference, right? If, Eventually. Yeah, just clear, just clear the high ground, essentially, right? Uh, but apart from that, the, the neutral here was good, you won the fight, whatever, okay. Um, yeah. 
though. Second point is Wormish, isn't it? Because first point was actually good. Yeah, so nice. Uh -uh. And this is where, like, fire planning stuff will come into play, right? Because here, deadass, I would just nano and win this fight. Nano, so they can't hold the choke, because cho holding this choke here is really, really strong for them against our comp. Um, because there's, there's just not many angles to take, right? Like, there's this one-ass window here, which Lucio can mark, uh, even Bastion can mark, May can mark with a wall. Um, but it's mainly the Lucio that'll, be, that'll do the marking with some Bastion nade stuff as well. And Sigma can mark it too, right? Like, just Nano and win this fight, I think. Like, Nano, literally just Nano scale and int in, is, is what I would have called here. Um, so yeah. And again... Edwards, heal, just get heal scale, right? Like, I don't know. Yeah, I was trying, we did like a little. Like, what, what's, what's the I was angle? What, what's Blue cooking? What, why, why? Like, if you're here, like, the only Gladiators. season, the only reason to not heal skull here is if you're playing here on this angle. Like, this is actually a really, really nice angle here, right? But you're not taking it, so. If happens, you can actually take this, like, unironically, come around, like, dead ass, and to come around, like, over here. What, do the gladiators reverse? Like, yeah, well, kind of. Um, All the way. <laughs> but honestly, like, who's gonna who's gonna who's gonna chase you? That's Kiriko. Who? who? Like, nobody. There's no tracer. Yeah. There's no sombra. There's no diva. There's no. Diva. You're not playing. You're playing against one of the most mobile comps in the game. Like, no one's gonna chase your ass mm. by coming through here. Like, you're fine. You've got all the. The only thing is use. like how long it takes. To get it's how long there. it takes. I mean, and then right. What, okay, what do you need to say if you're going for this flank? Yeah, just like chill for a bit. Right, say say you're flanking, because that will say to scale. Okay, well this guy's yeah. flanking, therefore I can't go aggro. Right? And then if he dies, it's it's, it's his fault. Um, but but yeah, like that needs to be. If you want to go for this thing, go for it. Um, you can go really really deep against the comp because no one's gonna mark you. And then if you get pushed, fine, TP away. Right, scale's right there. Um, so yeah. I mean, we we win this fight anyways. So the the matrix quite was good, and then we re-engage with Danaboost. So. Again, this is the push and pull I was talking about on one of the maps, right? It was like, they pushed with uh, Matrix, I call it M, we kite back, and then we push back in with Nano. And that's a very sort of basic push and pull, I think a contender's coach called Nessa, he called it ebb and flow, but that's a really sort of basic outlook of it. Um, so, so yeah. We do that We do that quite nicely, essentially, is, is the point. But yeah, you don't do it with Nano, we do it with Terra Surge, but same, same idea, same idea. That's fine, I don't care about dying, whatever, right? Wait, this, this is rough. Okay, so, you've won the fight, right? Full ults versus full ults, I'm, I'm gonna assume they're gonna get beat close in the fight, right? Um, what's the plan? Someone tell me. Someone cook something for me. Somebody. Uh, me? You're on that push to the high ground, you're on the push uh, where, like, Skelly is. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah, right, so like, so our neutral would probably be something like, um, scale, uh, actually, let's, 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 let's speed up. Fuck! I actually misclicked, fuck. <laughs> okay, there we go. Let's get to the actual fight and see what's up. Okay, so, the fight's occurring right now. What's the plan? Someone cook someone. Someone, someone cook something for me. Come on, come on. You're all uh... uni students. You should be smart. Can we rush mail? Uh, what's the issue with that? Why Why is rush mail thing not a good idea? Their mail can just wall them off and Lucio can speed out. Exactly, right? They're, they. I mean, they can flux it as well, they can counter mail, they can speed out. There's so many different things they can do, right? Um, I don't think... If they have no ults, fine. You can run it down, right? But I don't think that's a play here. Right, so we know, so just by eliminating my process of elimination, we know that rushing it down is not a good idea, right? However, what might they want to do? They want to rush out stuff. Yes, exactly, right? So we probably need to play in a way where Scale has to play really, really passive. Um, in that case, I'd probably recommend playing this high ground instead. There's more cover, there's a better kite path. Um, whereas here it's a little bit more sketchy because there's no cover, there's no direct cover here on high grounds, and the kite path is a bit in open space. Um, yeah, so I'd probably I'm play it, like yeah, play it in the future, okay? So, play then in the future, um, and then yeah, you can actually play it as well, right? So, my prediction is that just by naturally, by the process of a comp, we will force them to do something by having a Hanzo Kiriko play here, and then our core play here. Like, we will naturally, they will have, they have to do something. 
Otherwise, we win the game. Because our combo has better map control, we've got better poke damage. They need to rush us, essentially, right? Um, yeah. Whether that's speeding in with blizzards, whether that's speeding in with flux, whether that's speeding in with beats or uh, bastional, I don't care. We know they're going to rush us. Um, is probably the, the, is what's going to happen here. Right, so they're going to rush us, right? And then what we can do, we can probably look to re-engage with Nana Boost. Maybe um, Edward, you can be like, okay. Yeah. So if I'm in this game, this is what I'm going to call. Kite back, they're gonna rush with, they're gonna rush with speed and mail or something like that, so they're gonna rush us. Then we can push back in with Katsune Rush and then um Skell, I'm gonna TP to you and then we win the fight. Right? Very solid rudimentary fight plan. Um and if any and that also includes like mortals as well, right? So if you if Muffin, if you need to see to use Nano, if because I don't know, Keanu's low, or Keanu, you see that the May hasn't got cryo, um and you you look for an opportunity to see Mayalt, or because they rush in first with speed boost. So they haven't got speed to kite back, then you can mail back, right? Um, it's a sort of general sort of fight plan, right? So kite back, push back in. It's that simple. It's that simple. Um, so let's see what happens here. Okay, micro, right? So again, this is the whole issue with cover. <coughs> My voice. And this this is the cover issue, right? Um, where again, I don't know. I mean, you shouldn't have died to this as rock alone because rock does like eighty damage. So let's see. I think I hit Bastion Nade as well, maybe. Okay, Sigma Spam, <coughs> Bastion damage, Gun from Bastion, and Confusion, right? The question is, why doesn't he heal you? Okay, he does, it's just, it's just too slow, right? So, again, that's probably yeah. a cover issue. I asked probably why I won't do here anyways, and then you can get poke damage when they're rotating here in open space. Um, so again, that's probably some micro there. I assume they're gonna rush back. They're gonna rush in, sorry. That's what they should be doing. Yes, yes they are. Yes they are. All right now they're looking to SK or double key in with with flux in this case. Right, it could be mail. It could be beat. It could be bastional. It could be matrix. It doesn't matter. The point is that against this cob, you know eventually they're gonna run it down. Um, that's the point. So we don't get a good kite. There. Well, gosh, the kite's not too bad. Um, I, but the thing is like we kite because still dies, not because we're expecting the rush, which is the important thing. Right, because if Skull is, is you know, playing you know normal and is alive here, you guys are still going to play him anyways, right? which is the issue, um, if he doesn't die. right? So that's really the important thing. So the, the, the Kai here isn't that bad, um, but for the, the, re the reasons why we Kai aren't that great, if that makes sense. And also Keanu isn't Kai as well, so yeah. That's really, really important against, this, against the full comp, right? You know, naturally, I think, uh, uh, what's his name? Uh, a condensed coach called a voice cat? Oh, egoist cat. <coughs> My voice. <coughs> really, really a fantastic coach. Um, one of the best British coaches out there. Um, he described this as passive advantage. I'll probably link this to you guys. Um, it's a video he made. Um, it was a really, really good video. Really interesting as well. Um, but we would essentially have the passive advantage by having Hanzo and Kiriko here because we would force them to make a response. Um, again, otherwise, you know, we win. Um, that's sort of, sort of rudimentary outlook on it. Um, but yeah. Also, in terms of fight plans, um, does who wants to like call fight plans or make fight plans? Anyone in particular? Probably not, um, because it's a very hard thing to do. But... I was trying a little bit today, and I was I was trying. not good at it. <laughs> it's, 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 uh, I don't know why I was It's really picking. hard. It's really really hard. Like it's it's yeah. one of the hardest things. Like. Like well, to be fair, last thing, last thing was Samoa, but like, <laughs> yeah. Samoa was good. Um, like, were you guys playing on Samoa? No, because we I was had, spectating. We had a sick player. Oh, yeah, so I was spectating. Had, so, right? yeah. so the, yeah. the reason, the reason comms. why it's a lot easier to fire plan when you're specking is because your mental capacity isn't taken up by, um, your, also your short term memory isn't taken up by uh, mechanics or like uh, other stuff that you need to do, um. If I can remember my A-level psychology, but it was essentially, it was your short term memory gets overloaded essentially, which is why it's really hard to fight plan. Um, hence why heroes who have, you know, low mechanics, i.e. main supports, or people, <laughs> people who play main tanks, their mental capacity, their short term memory, isn't really that full, isn't really that full, sorry. So they're able to fight plan. That's why, you know, I mean, everyone here, I would, if, if I would be expecting Apple to fight plan if, if anyone's here, right? Um, but... If you haven't got the experience to do, to do that, it's really, really hard. Um, <coughs> so, yeah. 
Um, I was actually even thinking I was when I joined the Angels, I was saying like if it's really bad and like I don't know whether it's Edwards or Muffin or anyone on the team, um, or Nihilo or like Apple, if you guys are in a, unable to fight plan and it's really hurting our ability to like play these comps well, I would probably have to come in and play because I obviously. I mean, me being the coach, right, I've actually had to make fire plans for, like, a very long time. Um, so I can do that in-game. I, I did it last term for, this, for the uh, angles, too. Um, but we'll see how it goes this time. It's something I would really like to learn to do, but yeah. I have no... I have no like, obviously, it's, 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 it's natural. Your, it your natural... It's just... It's, it's a mixture of game knowledge and mental capacity. Um, I mean, obviously, like, when, when you've coach the game for like a past year or two then you know how comps play into each other you know the sort of neutrals that are, are being set up um so i find it relatively intuitive to do um but yeah it's, it's it's literally like one thing that can help is doing stuff like this right like actually thinking having i think again another coach uh sage he is another eu coach he goes to bristol university does english um this is all the relevant relevant information about him <laughs> But essentially, he's a very smart guy, right, that's my point. Um, he has a sort of practice for his players where he'll give them, like, 15 to 20 seconds to fight plan, right? So, like, again, this is actually a great example, right? Um, someone makes... If you got... With the ults on the board here, someone make a fight plan, like, now, right? In the next 15 to 20 seconds. Because in an actual game, this is something you'll have to do, right? So, like, what do you do here? Come on, give me... Throw shit at me. Give me ideas. Don't use all four ults. You want, you want, you want to pay, you ideally you want to bait out one of the ults because they want to rush you down with. Uh, obviously, they they have um, may ult and they have a B, so they they don't mind rushing you out. They don't mind rushing down, right? So I mean, yeah, so be... you want to bait them out. Yeah, right. So like, what might they? If if we've got a Kiriko here, so actually we'll speed up here because they might not hold the show here. Yeah, they're not holding it. Are they? Yeah, they're not. They're not. They're not. Yeah, they're coming back. Okay. So I'm gonna predict something, okay? I'm gonna predict that they're gonna uh, rush with blizzards, um, or speeding with blizzards, and then they're gonna beat to sustain f through whatever we're gonna go, th we're gonna go through, right? Um, in order to, to to beat that, we're gonna have to kite out their their amp. Um, we might have to blizzard to counter uh, and to prevent their rush, um, and then continue rush afterwards, right? After their beat yeah. has dissipated and after their their the push is gone, back. yeah, push back. And Scale's on a good flank here. Um, I should be with him. I mean, the question is, why yeah. Why aren't you? Right? Why not? There's <laughs> no reason not to be. Is it, it, I Just assume it's a Kasuna rush. Uh, 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 this is fun, actually, right? Oh, wait, yeah, 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 I remember. It's probably it's the Kasuna rush. You know, in, and then... Um, and then TP, right? I never this, TP'd. This is a fantastic angle, right? Like, it's a really, really, really good angle. Um, and you can see, right, if the enemy team... They're not, they're not doing this very well, right? But if the enemy team... Uh, in their comp right now, do fuck all, we will win. Right? You can see this by the cooldown trades, right? They're using wall, they're mace half HP, they're kiting back, they're all stacked together, right? We will win this fight over time if they don't do anything, because we have the passive advantage here. So, so far, fight is going well for us. Okay, now now they're actually starting to do stuff, right? Now we're within, we're, uh, we're within close range, so now we probably need to get ready to kite back, um, and then you need to TP the fuck out of there, Muffin needs to be playing yep. probably closer to this corner here to avoid the blizzards. Um, Nihelo, oh sorry, Apple will be fine because of Fortify, whatever. Um, and then Keanu should be fine as well because of Cryo. So in, in reality here, we should be fine through blizzards. Um, but really, is this, right? This needs to help. Ah, flashbang. No. <laughs> yeah, they beat as well. Okay, two, they use two ops there. We use two as well. Okay, we blizzard as well. That's completely fine. So far, the fight's still going okay for us. I think it's still going okay. Okay, good blizzard too. Really good blizzard here, actually, right? The wall's not great, but uh, the blizzard's good as well. So I'd probably want, want a wall here, split off these guys, and you guys can clean them up, right? Very sort of simple sort of fight plan, right? But the blizzard is actually really, really good. It splits off these guys. Um, so yeah, good blizzards. Um, so far, so good. Ooh. So far, not so good. Um, so Apple, oh boy. What happens to his fortify? Has he got fortify? Uh, he uses it now. But he used it in... Yeah. yeah, yeah, so let's see. Too early, too early, right? Like, you're literally, you're literally full HP right now. Um, You've got so much natural cover here to use, there's just no reason to use Fortify, right? And again, if we're fight planning, and we're like, this may as blizzards, 
you're gonna keep the fortify, right? But you're not in that mindset again. A goalie scout, a great coach. He mentions mindset, right? If players are in the correct mindset, then their abilities and the way they use their cooldowns are gonna be so much better because they're in the correct mindset of like this is what a comp is booked to do. Right? But we're not in that mindset. We're not in the mindset of okay, we need to kite blizzards. We're no nobody's thinking that right now. Nobody. Um, which means that we waste cooldowns like fortify, right? So. <laughs> Not great. Yeah, I think if, if we saved Fortify and had the wall for uh, I think we definitely should have won. Yeah, yeah, I, I agree too. Right, so, the Fortify, not great. And again, it's not, you know, the reason why you're not thinking of it is because nobody's in the correct mindset of, okay, they're going to rush us with, with Blizzard, right? They're going to they're gonna reel us in uh, and include it close range and then they're going to Blizzard us, right? Nobody's thinking that. Um, hence why we, we, you know, our corners are a bit sloppy, right? But even then, even then, the main question is, why is Kiriko not here? Alright, that's really the main question. So, Edward, why, why, why aren't you there? I got distracted by the blizzard. Well, I mean, the funny thing is, right, if you're here with Skell, right, mm. I've said this to you a I'm billion... I'm not even dealing I've with the this, blizzard. Yeah, right, I've said this to you a thousand, a thousand times. Whenever you're main, you will always you take, take more damage, damage, damage and deal less of it yourself. Right? And not just you, but your team as well. Right, because look at Apple, right? Frozen. Imagine if you're here. Suzu, bam, he lives. Right, and then you can go back into Kasune Rush, gets his Fortify back immediately. You can start healing scale, right? Like, this fight becomes so much more winnable. So much more winnable if you were to still scale. Right? Um, yeah, right. So, not really not great there. Have you got Suzu? Uh, yeah, probably have to use it on yourself, I think. Let's see how you use Suzu here. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Bruh. Bruh. You, okay, you, so you Suzu and Maze got Cryo, and then you missed the Suzu onto Fortify, right? Or to onto the Beast Soy, right? Yeah, really not great here. Again, this is a fight lost to Micro. It's a fight lost to Mindset and a fight lost to Micro. Right, and again, oh wow, imagine if a Kimiko was here. Oh, you are actually here, okay, fair enough. Okay, but you missed. Okay, fuck me. Christ. <laughs> okay, so you finally TP the scale, right? Let's slow it down. 2.25. Oh no. Oh god. Let's see how much how much of food do you miss? Blue, blue. You missed everything. And then it's too late. Some yellow. Already too late. Yep. Jesus Christ. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, you you if you're here or if you're already here with scale. Like, again, you Suzu or Risa, and then you can, like, stand here, heal your hands up, because you can actually see him. You've got LOS onto him. You're not panicking around, right? So, yeah. You, uh, not great there. Again, it's a, I think it's a mindset issue. Um, I really, that fight there, honestly, the, it was, it comes down to micro. It really does. Um, nobody's in the correct mindset, right? Um, we can get to Rush here, and then TP main. Or TP to the, um, off angle, right? So, that fight there... <coughs> We pushed them with Kutsune, which is fine. I think that's fine because they were giving up space um, and they, they weren't really going proactively. They were cutting back. I think it's fine to go in with Kutsune Rush. I think that's completely fine. Then they cut it back a little bit and then they pushed back in with Blizzards. Call it B. A Blizz. And then we pushed right back into them as well. Like this. And then we had our own Blizzards. Um, I think they also use B there as well. Right? Blizz, and I call that plus beats. Plus beats. So that's how that fight goes, um, in terms of like, the, the description, right? And then in terms of like what, how we can actually sort of leverage this. As soon as you Kutsune rush, you need to like piss off from the uh, the, the blizz and the beats. Um, again, you need to be directly on top of scale, right? Um, yeah, really not great there. And also, by the way, you're considering into a brawl comp, into a fucking brawl comp. You are not gonna get shit done by throwing Katsune or throwing Kunaized in, in Katsune Rush into a wall comp, I'm sorry. It's not gonna happen. Think think of angles as a damage amplifier in themselves. I think that's a good way of looking at it. Okay, let's see the spot here. Could you would you suggest like using rush on flanks then? Like even if it's just Yeah, the, uh... I, I uh, yeah, I've told I've told I've told this to Edward too in the past. Um okay. I think in in team play and when you've got when you've got an Arisa who's really, really cool down reliance, I think it's completely fine and also muffin as well. Um and also your your May as well. Um I think it's completely fine to rush down main. 
it gives you a cool way more sustain. You've got a really cyclical sort of comp with the May and the um the Arisa. Uh, so I think it's fine to consider you know I mean. But I've talked to everyone about it too. Uh, I think on maps that are more open and against verse less poorly comps. So say you're playing into uh uh like again I like got Echo Mercy, right? Um like that's the more with that stuff, right? Echo Mercy. Yeah. I think and your Hanzo Kiriko, I think it's completely fine. Completely fine to consume wash your Hanzo. Um and then when you win that jewel, you win that flank. Um and then yeah, you sort of collapse onto them again from two different angles. I think that's completely fine. Um but yeah. In this sort of scenario here where again you want more sustained because your comms really cyclical, the map's really, really narrow. Um, and you're all you've already like you don't need to win the flank wars, right? Because you're playing against this comp, right? Who's gonna out duel you, right? Nobody, right? No one's out dueling a hands of Kiriko in this comp, so you don't need the Kasune rush, right? Um, but yeah, in other comps where you might feel like it's harder to duel, like on like on uh, not so Vasa, um, Drunk City, then it might have been better to Kasune rush that, um, because you were losing duels, so all right, I guess. Hello, Kido. Hello. Trying to say hi and checking how things are going. Oh, yeah. yeah, so to give a He's just cooking us. Uh yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Um I'm being I'm being relatively yeah, I mean the, the the way a Yeti described it to me was like uh aggressive but direct or something like that. Um or um, what your style or my style, yeah. Um <laughs> that's how I am, so yeah. I mean in OD it works, so <laughs> no it's fine. Enough. If anyone's like not cool with that, by the way, then I'm fine changing styles or whatever. Um, but it's just yeah, like, oh, we've well, also got through at the welfare officer if anyone needs. Uh... Yeah, yeah. If I, in case, in case I cook you guys too hard, yeah, obviously, right? Um, but yeah. So yeah, so far, That's I mean, to, to give to give a bit quick play donkey dog um, of like what sort of uh, happened or like how the um, what the angles have to do. Um, I think our overall macro's been fine. You know, I think the last fight, for example, like scale was like a, we had a Hanzo here. Um, we had, um, yeah, basically, yeah, Hanzo here. Um, sometimes it was a bit slow to come to, to Hanzo, and I think in terms of fight planning, um, I'm trying to get these guys to, like, sort of try and have a brief or, like, a, uh, a good structure or good mindset in terms of, like, making fight plans, which is basically, they're gonna want to S key on us, or, so W key onto us, um, especially if we have multiple angles at once. So, for example, um, if we're, if we've got Hanzo Kiriko here on the high grounds, ugh, and then like our Arisa, May, and Ana back here, um, they're gonna rush us. They're gonna rush the these guys on on main, um, and hopefully like it should be relatively telegraphed. And the general sort of fight plan is kite back and then push back in, right? And that will look different each fight depending on the ults. But that's sort of the general sort of uh structure we're looking at. Against bad ball comps or against bad ball teams, they'll stand still and we'll just naturally win because we have the passive advantage. We've got the angles. We've got the more poke. Um, but yeah. Mm -hmm. So like here, so like here for example, right? Where should where where should we be? Where should the hands of Kiriko be? On the side. Yes, right. It's so like either um, here, right, or either here. Right, either should one. also just just a thought because they're not running a sim Anna on high ground, like the right high ground. That's what like I would say. Right? Ye yeah. Or even yeah. rotate the long way around, like pre-fight, like no, yeah, you want to go yeah, the high yeah. That's a good point. I didn't thought that. That's a good point. Um, because I... you can get nades from there and. You don't want Anna. Anna's just gonna be the one to, they're gonna rush on to. Yeah. So you don't want to be playing over. So if that's gonna, yeah, I think that's a really good point. Actually, I, I didn't think of that. Um, so if that's gonna happen, then Muffin needs to call that and say to Apple, just chill. I'm gonna mm. rotate to high ground, right? That's all you need to say. Um, and then looking for a nade, right? Um, so yeah, good point there. If Muffin, also, and... sorry, go on, yeah. If me and Muffin go together through the high ground, is it worth then Teddy staying with the Orisa? Yeah, 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 yeah. It would be and then, that. yeah, yeah. And so then like, Teddy can TP out when can the rush TP, happens. right? So like for example again, you can be here, it's so like Hanzo Ana here, uh Kiriko Orisa here, and then me as well. Um and then Ana can get a nade, drop off, and then you can TP back, right? Something like that. Also, um this is quite creative. Um how could we get Muffin to come through here? Like the room. Mm-hmm. Sorry? No wall up, yeah. Wall up, right? Wall up. Yeah, right? So, again, it's just being a little bit creative, thinking outside the box a little, right? Like, we can wall up here, right? And then, who's gonna think of that? Nobody. No one's thinking of that in, the, in their right mind. Um, so, again, we can wall up here, 
Again, imagine. Let me play the fight here, right? I'll play the fight from here and imagine an honor here. Like, imagine, like, you sleep this Baptiste and then you get, like, a nade here, right? That's insane, right? And then you win the file for that, right? Um, or something like that. Um, okay, you, you, you wall here with your, like, your, your mate honor, come up here. You sleep the Baptiste, you nade here, and then you nano your, your Arisa or you nano your, your Hanzo. Boom, fight done. Jova, right? Jova. Um, so, again, another fight plan, right? Just being a little bit creative with walls. Um, yeah. Uh, what other fight plans could we do? Swap that and for me and Hanzo. Uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, I've gone through that before, right? Um, what are they like? What are they likely to do here? Uh, Bastion with the window, do you think? Yeah, right. So they're gonna probably gonna window. I mean, the Baptiste is pl probably the Baptiste is looking for his own individual value, but in some sort of way, again, they're gonna probably look to rush here, or they're gonna window here, either flush up scale or rush these guys, right? Um, again, we need to be anticipating that. So, I think Skull, you die here. I, think I get, I get yeah. one shot by the Bastion. That nade is fucking okay, crazy. I'm, I'm not gonna, I, I'm not gonna right. be harsh on you there. That's fair enough. Um, so I see you like, go. Nade, nade, and two dog. bullets, and you're dead. So you're good. Uh, is there what? anything I should do there? There's nothing oh, much no. you can really do Just that. Just die so um, fast. Like... <laughs> by the time I pressed E. What could you do with your ability to scale? Also, yeah, what could you do? Sonic. Yeah, right, so, so probably like Sonic either on here to see if anyone's scouting here. So ideally, if I was coaching blue team, I'd be like, have a Lucio here, he's denied the hands over. Uh, that's what I'd be saying. Um, so Sonic here, in case you see a Lucio here. Or, if you don't hear the Lucio, Sonic here, so you know what you're shooting. Um, just to give you some more information, right? Um, yeah. And also, what do you think about the timing of this? Too early. Too early, yeah, right? Tank look, at, look at your Arisa, like fucking miles behind, miles away from where she wants to be. Um, so again, it's a bit too early here, right? And I'm not saying it's not you can't poke here, right? But you need to be really, really sort of passive here as well, um, because a few shots plus bash and nade, you're cooked. Um, so if I notice the Baptiste, I could be shooting him from or like, relative the Baptiste, safe. right? You can literally just be here and then shoot the Baptiste, in, uh, right? Yeah. Or like be in here, right? Just, That's... Peek, just peek through the door, yeah. Exactly, right? So. Yeah, I think at the time no one called about Baptiste because I was I was spectating obviously, but like I saw Baptiste's like uh, right click start from the right, but nobody called her. Mm. And I think, I think obviously if, if someone called her, then it will be so much easier for scouts to sort that out. Yeah, for sure. Um, yeah. Okay. I mean, you can see like this. This. I mean, the, the team they they clearly flat plan this, right? Like the Baptiste doesn't do this without saying so. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. The Baptiste, I mean, honestly, the Baptiste probably said something like, guys, I want to get an individual matrix. Um, so, that's probably what he did, right? You got a good matrix on a good angle. Um, but yeah. Okay. That one isn't too much fault. I mean, you kind of got blew up there in, in one shot, so... Not too, too much, but there was things you could have done that to, to prevent that from happening. Okay. Yeah, and what's the f what are the five plans here? Uh, maybe Terra Surge Dragon. Terra Surge Dragon, yeah, that's a really good one. Um, Terra Surge here, and then Dragon, like somewhere near the Terra Surge, out on the outskirts of it, so they have the like, between the rock and hard place. Um, that's a, probably another uh, good thing as well. And the one thing I want to raise here is again, this is a clear, clear fight plan here. Right, these guys clearly come to do this. Right, um. And it's it's fine just being a little bit creative with your with your mate walls, right? Um, if you want to mate wall up here and fight these guys, by all means do it. Um, but again, like I think that you need, it's it's just something you, you money to come. Um, die to that. Let's go die to that, right? Um, got them off guard, right? And they honestly, you kind of deserve to die there because it was a, it was a good fight, but fight plan by them. So, I mean, one, two, three ults. Yeah, they're at an ult disadvantage here, so they, they need to do something risky. It was a good fight, fight plan by them. Um, question is, your Sonic. Oh boy, don't tell me you sonic that If you sonic that I'm gonna kill you. Why did I sonic? Don't sonic, don't you dare. Don't you fucking dare. <laughs> there uh, we go. Big sonic. Hmm, imagine if you sonic here, so you could actually see the maid doing this quirky ass fight plan, and then you probably don't want to walk them up immediately. Hmm, I wonder. Yeah. That would I, be pretty smart, actually. That would have been really smart, yeah. Hmm. 
Hmm. Does the Baptiste triple dink me here or some shit? Because the May body shots me and I fucking die. That's 24 damage. So that's 24 plus 40. That's 96 damage, I think. Um, so, yeah, yeah, nice. To, yeah, basically full, full damage there. Half to half HP. So, yeah, you, the, yeah, yeah. So, oh. like, the, the, the Baptiste gets a good burst and then the May uh, shoots you in the body or something. And then you die. Um, so, slight bra moment there, I'm not gonna lie, but, you know, we move. And again, it's, 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 a being a it's being a little bit more aware, and again, a being in the correct mindset as well. Um, so probably, in this fight, I'm looking at a thing combo, so what's gonna happen? Again, our hands of Kiriko's gonna come through here, right? Um, Sonic the Sangle, um, and then get a clear Terror Surge plus Dragon Strike. If I can spell my I got... I did get caught off because this was the first time they'd stacked this angle. Like it they was. had the Baptiste here alone last fight, and but before that they'd always just been all been in main. Yeah, right. Um, so it's good. That's... It's a good. It's a good play by them, but again, all prevented by Sonic. So yeah, I should be Soniking more, even if they're not consistently flanking. Yeah. And then this fire is cooked. So. And then here, honestly, we'll probably. Is there anything I can do to keep Skell alive there? Uh, let's see from your preview. Maybe it's easy. Because you didn't die immediately, so. No. It wasn't like it wasn't like the Bastion one, so we'll see. Yeah. Okay, that's kind of unfortunate there, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. Um yeah, because really yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. like uh, if you play below them the healing's just too slow. I still think it's it's, it's it's still I still think it's like a relatively like team again, this team based thing, right? If everyone's in the correct mindset to like take this map control here. Um, then, you know, Dragon Strike here, that's fine. Um, yeah, so, yeah. And here, we need to be in the mindset to get the fuck out, because, again, they're gonna S-key on, they'll W-key onto us, I keep saying S-key. We need to S-key, they need to, they're gonna, they're gonna yeah. W-key onto us. Yeah, alright, so... And then they do a combo. Okay, next fight. This one, I think we, I think we win. In this one, I think. They're, they're, they're down with their ults. Mm -mm. Okay, so now that they're, they're all in the main, they're all in the main right now. Really good for us. Okay. See on who's that? Nice oh, block. That's yeah, not a great crowd there. The wall is too early as well. So like, yeah, right. Um, the, so our CDs are here too early. Dragon Strike is good, but yeah, okay. I know. That, I mean, we're just sort of brute forcing it with ults here, right? Um, and it's kind of working because we're brute forcing it, but again, I don't think any of these ults have been really purposeful, so to say. Um, we've kind of just seen them walk in main and then press Q. Um, like again, the the ice wall hasn't wasn't thoughtful. The cry wasn't thoughtful. The dragon wasn't that thoughtful. Um, the nano wasn't that thoughtful either. I think you just saw your visa walk forward and, uh, and and nano. Like again here, right? Like all all you guys needed to really do here. Um, God, I hate backing up for five seconds. Fuck me. Uh, let's go back here a little bit. Da -da. Alright, someone give me a fire plan. Uh, we need we it would be ideal to find a way to combo Arisa with Hanzo ult. Yeah. Yeah. So like, what is, what's the uh, staging for that? It's a bit tricky because like the Arisa has to walk forward first, and then I dragon strike on top of her, and then she ults. Yeah. Right. So if you're so... gonna go for this flank here, you need to do it now because the Arisa is already relatively close. So you need to go for that now. Um, yeah. And then Hanzo Kiriko here. Uh, Arisa going in with Terra Surge. Um, and then two angles here, right? And we kind of ha have that going on. So, right here. <clears throat> I think yeah. the reason I dragoned might have... Maybe I split them or something? Um... To split them, because I thought they were going to rush, obviously. So I wanted us to have time to do yeah. the rotation. Uh, yeah. There's about... And yeah, Muffin here. Um, this is like... Uh, how do I? It's called it's called dynamic positioning. Um, it, but like it's like every it's probably like the the final layer of like positioning with honor. Um, but here, look how long you stack you you stand in the main four and you don't move. 
Oh wow, you stand there very long. Okay, so we'll go for 542. Five like how long you stand there. Oh, look what happens, right? Yeah. Right, right. You stat so that is static positioning. It's not dynamic at all. Right? Where should you have moved to throughout that entire fight? Mm, I mean, I could have moved up to like Carter, then up to like stairs, maybe. Yeah, right, that's probably the only thing you can, you can really do. Right? So one of the it just feels so open walking through. Uh, I mean. I mean, here's the thing, right? Who are the enemy team looking at? Yeah, yeah. I guess I should just trust the flank, right. basically. Right? Yeah, right. Who are they all looking at? Yeah. Yeah. Right, Who's the, is the main thinking about you rotating through her? Like, right. fuck no. Right, she's no. solely focused no, on yeah. getting her visit off, right? Uh, as you can see, the little point things, right? They're all looking at the Orisa, right? Because your Orisa's, your Orisa's nano boosted. Going balls deep, and you have a hands of Kyogre flanking, right? You need to move. Yeah. Um, yeah. You need to move. It's funny, right? It's like, it's like, it's, it's in everything. It's like in every dynamic positioning, is, is in everything, right? From like boxing to like football to like um, Valorant to, to Overwatch, right? It's literally in everything. You cannot stand still. You need to move. And if you moved here, you're fine, right? Now, one of two things yeah. happen. You move here, and the Vapsi stays here. In that case, you just draw the Bapsis, you nail them, you sleep and whatever, right? And then the Keanu can help you, right? Um, or two, you avoid the Bapsis, who's actually doing the thing I'm talking about. He's moving, right? Mm. He was he was here at the at, he was here. Okay, he's so his entire path has gone like this. That's his bit. That's been his path thing, right? And it's actually this is a really really fantastic rotation from the Bapsis. A really good dynamic positioning. Right? That's a perfect example of it. It's there, right? And you need to be doing the same thing, right? If you're here. You can sort of counteract it, right? So, which means that it takes longer for the Bapsis to get value. Um, but yeah, right? So, yeah, you need to move. Funny enough, you actually live there, right? If, you, if you're here, you kill Keanu, you, you're alive yourself, and yeah. you win the fight there, right? Easily. Without having to use Katsune Rush, um, or even Terror Surge, I think, that you end up using. So, really messy fight there. You don't need to use Terror Surge. Either. And especially against dive, right? Especially against dive. So this is against brawl, right? Um, again, dynamic positioning isn't isn't everything, right? Normally against brawl, it's to uh, it's either aggressive or defensive. Aggressive is looking for nades. That's when you want to be going for a ag uh, aggressive dynamic positioning. Defensive is uh kiting. Um, uh, so either you kite a dive, um, or you uh or you cut their rush, um, effectively, right? And again. Whenever you're down main, you do less damage and you take more of it yourself. Um, so you need to move. Yeah, that fight there, very messy. Yeah, here's where I'm gonna get a little bit annoyed. Um, because in reality here, uh like off the get-go, off the get-go, like I need I need I'm sorry, I need like I can't you can't die there, right? So he's, he's coming a, a bit further back. Like off the get go, like I need, like you need your ass needs to be here on helping skill, right? And again, ideally, I'm, I'm lagging. Is it, is it, am I all good? Am I, am I, am I good? Because I, I saw the sign thing. Yes. Think so, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. One sec. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I lagged out. I'm lagging. I'm lagging. Oh, I'm lagging. Are you alright? Sound crystal clear in Discord. <laughs> I'm, am, am I am I good in Discord? Hello, hello. Yeah. 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 Okay. Okay. Yeah. I'm. I'm. Just, I'm yeah. probably. Oh my god. I'm. Why am I lagging so much? My fucking connection. Oh my god, bro. Okay. Wait. You need that high ground is like so small. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, I've lagged out, unfortunately. Um, which is unfortunate. Uh, uh. So some of you guys are lagging out too. A little bit. Are uh, we? 
Are we? Um, that's because of me. No, it's no, no one else is. Because of me. Like it. <laughs> I don't think it's going to happen. Okay, give me like I want to quickly go over the third point and see what happens, and then call it a day. Yeah. Okay. Uh, please load. I watch. I'm gonna get some food in the microwave. I get some. Get some food. Yes. Thank you, coach. <laughs> Let me screen again. I remember third point here was really...